Hi folks. So this video is actually unscripted because I just thought that I would be kind of honest and open with you on this. I've been making Manny Mando's history now for the last 10 years, um, more than 10 years now. This time 10 years ago, I was posting the World War One in six minutes video. It was in around this time. So we've come a long way since then, ups and downs. Um, but, you know, in a, in, a, in a world where indeed the start of this year has seen so many, so many, I am leaving YouTube uh, videos up on YouTube. I don't want to be one of those, um, but, it, you know, the reason why so many people are is because YouTube is becoming more and more difficult to do and make a living from. Um, I have been lucky that I have been able to make some living from YouTube. I've been doing this, I've been working as a creative artist, actor, writer, illustrator, all of those different things now for uh, since 2016, um, where I've been not just making videos, but going into schools, doing history workshops, um, uh, filmmaking workshops, animation workshops, um, and writing, acting, producing my own plays, acting in other people's plays, recording radio dramas for RTE and BBC. I do loads of things. I do loads and loads of things. Um, but Manny Mandel's history is a huge passion of mine. Um, it has been a pet project for, now I say I've been making these for 10 years. Manny Man has been with me for almost 20 years, actually over 20 years. Today is my birthday. <laughs> Today is my birthday. I've turned 35, so I don't know if you want to call this a midlife crisis or what. <laughs> um, but <laughs> uh, the joys of unscripted. Um, yeah. But yeah, so I'm, I'm 35 today and I'm handling it really well. Um, <laughs> but yeah, seriously though, I want to continue to be able to do these. I am currently making a video about Israel and Palestine where I have gone all the way back to like 1200 BC and I've been working on this since November um, and I have been work, working on that uh, until obviously you know I, I still have the, the Monarchs of England videos in the pipeline um, but this video had to take precedence because obviously everything that is happening now, I wanted to try and help clarify some of that history. So that will be coming out as soon as I can get it finished. Right now I'm up uh, as far as the as World War One. So I've gone from 1200 BC up as far as World War One. And so that's where I'm at right now. And obviously we have a lot of history to go from then, but I hope to get it finished sooner rather than later. All, none of that work that I have been doing, as I said, since November is paid for up front, except for the donations that come through Patreon. Patreon.com forward slash John D. Really. Um, but, you know, I have been paying for that labor myself out of my own business and whatever scant ad revenue comes in through YouTube. That is what has been paying for this labor. And where we're at in the world and the global economy and all of that, it's becoming less viable. Now, obviously, you know, you're like, well, John, why don't you make, you know, loads of, loads of videos, loads of smaller videos? Well, that's partially why I started a series, uh, Draw Your Own Pokedex, which is uh, a much more kind of uh, light-hearted, frivolous uh, series where we're drawing Pokemon uh, and they're drawing tutorials. I want to teach people how to draw and uh, show people different drawing techniques um, that I've picked up uh, over the years. So I thought, you know what? Everybody loves Pokemon. Let's draw Pokemon. And so we're drawing Pokemon. And I started uploading them onto my other channel, John D. Really Does Stuff. Um, but as much as a you know a, a wishful thinking as it was for me to be like yeah well i mean i i don't want to clutter my main channel with pokemon when i've got history here but i've come to the conclusion where i can't afford to do that 
um, you know, if if I want to continue to make all of this content, um, then I have to put those onto this channel. Don't get me wrong, like it's 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 not like it's bad content. I really I'm really proud of this uh, new series uh, so far. <laughs> it's just very different from history. Uh, for those who have subscribed for history, they're like, ah, Pokemon drawing tutorials. Manny Man does history is still happening and it is still coming. Uh, but they just take much longer to produce than Pokemon, draw your own Pokemon, because, you know, an episode of draw your own Pokemon takes maybe about five hours to produce. Whereas Manny Man does history takes months. It has, it has become more and more of a challenge, but, you know, personally as well, like I have a baby, he's nearly one years old, like, you know, so it's been a very busy year personally. Um, but on top of that, you know, um, uh, it's it's tough it's tough so um i am appealing to you out there um that uh, i really need your support like i know i throw these things out at the end of the video you know this video is kindly supported by my supporters on patreon and i i really really appreciate everyone who supports me on patreon and so this, this message is not for you, this is for everyone else who's been watching my stuff for free for the last 10 years. It, it's not enough, I'm not making enough on Patreon. Um, and I know, again, we're going through a very, very difficult time, um, financially, economically. Um, so I, if you cannot afford it, that's fine. But if you can afford it, please, consider supporting this channel you know both for Manny Man Does History and Draw Your Own Pokemon and you know what there'll be other little creative projects because I you know I'm a creative person and I want to continue being creative if I can it's it is a privilege um but I also feel like I have a you know a, a responsibility in that I have been helping people learn about history the amount of of people in the last 10 years who have come up to me and said how much they love my videos, how every single year in and around kind of May, June, summer exam time or in the lead up to Christmas, I get so many people from high school, from college who are commenting, go, either going, you know, is anybody else here because there's a history exam? Or, um, you know, oh my, oh my God, you saved, you, you saved me in my, in my finals. And, and I love that. I love that I'm able to help make sense of that for people because I wanted that when I was in secondary school, in high school, I wanted that. And that's where Manny Man came out of. Um, I wanted a comic book version of King Lear I couldn't find a decent one that I liked, so I drew the whole thing in Manny Man. Uh, like that's another project that I would love to bring to YouTube. Um, but just right now, what I'm having to concentrate my time on is just so much because, uh, um, like a, a lot of the external projects that I'm having to work with, which I do love working on, but if basically if you want me to be producing more and more Manny Man does history, at a faster rate obviously i can only work so fast but it, i won't be having to work on other projects as often um but because youtube is not paying as much right now that's why i'm having to make sure every single month i'm working for a film festival or i'm working for um you know an arts festival and i love that they shout out to rathmullen film festival and ergal arts festival you just have kept me going so much the last couple of years and i love that um but like <laughs> they're only like two three months out of the year and trying to just kind of guarantee that there's going to be enough money in the bank to pay myself you know i've been running this as a business um and it's been getting very tough um so this is my 
to you. Um, I know there are loads of charitable, other charitable things that you can kind of be out there doing and much more noble things than helping me, but at the same time, I think there is a certain nobility in what I do in wanting to provide free education for people. Free, you know, when there's a huge push against um, critical race theory in America, I was like, I want to do a video about the entire civil rights movement so that there's a resource there for, I mean, obviously there's loads of other resources, but you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I'm, I want to continue to be able to educate folks. Um, and for those of you out there who are able to support my work, who have appreciated my work for years, uh, if you're a teacher out there who feels like they can afford a little bit, or if anybody, if you feel like you can afford a little bit, it could be just a euro a month, you know. I, I'm in the process of setting up my memberships on YouTube as well, so if you want to join via there, happy days. Um, I'm in the process, there's going to be loads of uh, loads of benefits in doing that. I don't know what they are right now, I'm being honest. Like this, this is kind of where I'm at too, where I'm just... Taking it as it comes. Um, I'm. <laughs> this is the side that I never show of being a YouTuber. You know, I'm always sitting here, you know, doing the hi, folks. So, welcome to Money Mandel's history. And, uh, you know, this video was brought to you, but like, this is the reality of it. And a lot of people struggle with it, you know. So many YouTubers put up a, a brave face of hi, you know, oh wow. It's so tough. It can be very lonely at times. Um, but at the same time, I love it. When it's able to support me, I love it. When I'm not sitting there going, like working for hours a day on end, drawing these pictures going, is this going to pay the bills? It's like this whole existential crisis, you know? If I can have that little bit more um, surety in going, yes, this is paying the bills, you know? Otherwise, I might have to give it up. And I hate to say that. I really, really hate to say that uh, because I love it. Um, and also, I don't want to leave my Monarchs of England series unfinished, but like, if it's getting to a point where I do not have the capacity to make these and have them make money, um, because right now they're not making enough money. Um, so yeah, you know, a euro a month. Like if out of, out of my 250,000 subscribers, which the YouTube algorithm doesn't really like to give me access to for reasons, you know, because that's all the algorithm's a whole other genre of complaints. And um, but yeah, like I mean, if two hundred of you, or even two thousand of you, give me one year a month on Patreon or membership. Again, I need to work out how the membership works. Probably should have recorded this after I sorted out my membership. But again. <clears throat> Welcome to my world. Um, I'm just trying to make it work as it, uh, as it goes. <sighs> I apologize for this being super depressing. <laughs> I apologize this for being brutally honest. Um, but this is where we're at. Um, and if there's some of you out there, not all of you, because Plenty of you are probably struggling more than me, or plenty of you don't have an income or whatever. But for the few out there who do have the spare money and who have appreciated my work for years, I'm only one person. 
I am only one person. Like, this is the thing. I don't have a whole team behind me. I can't afford a whole team behind me. I would love a team that could edit and research and write and um, fact check and, uh, you know, c color and, you know, because, like, I, mean, I, I do love doing the, doing the illustrations and stuff. But, like, or even add more animation to the videos, you know, get more movement and stuff. You know, that's something that technically I could do myself, but I don't, I can't, I, I can't afford to bring anybody else on. I, right now I am doing the job of uh, the writer, artist, the illustrator, editor, voice recorder, editor, like all, all that's doable on its own. But on the other hand, I'm also trying to organize merchandise. I'm failing miserably at that, to be very honest. Um, and just a, a manager, you know, I'm managing my schedule um, of, and you're like, John, first word problems. Sure, you know, um, like to be honest, if this, was a channel where I was, you know, doing movie reviews or something, I wouldn't feel so compelled to ask you for help. But because I have seen people genuinely benefit from my videos, students, teachers, whoever, because I have seen the actual benefit of people learning about history, I feel compelled to not just give up. You know, I see a, that, that there is a benefit in this, that people benefit from my videos. And I want to continue to be able to do that. So, patreon.com forward slash John Lee Or probably by the time I upload this, um, I'll uh, have the membership set up, maybe. We'll see, probably. If, if it is set up, join there. Join there. Um. <sighs> Happy birthday, John. <laughs> oh, God. So don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and hit the bell icon. You'll never be able to watch me do say that ever again without going, he's completely faking it. Everybody's faking it. It's YouTube. You know, everybody has a YouTube voice. You know, hi folks, you know, it's and then you meet them in real life and they're like, you don't sound like and, you know, nobody ever recognized me until I do the they're like, oh are you the guy who does does those videos? And then I do the voice. The politics of 19th century Europe were messy. Let's change. And they're like, oh yeah. You know? It's YouTube. <laughs> Nothing is real. <sighs> but yeah. Kids, don't become a YouTuber. Like, I love what I do. But uh, I just wish that uh, I was able to get paid for it. More than what I currently do. Um... I'm just gonna leave that long pause in there. That was not a, none of this has been acting. You know, I am an actor, but none of this has been acting. That was a genuine little existential. <laughs> oh, there's the phone. The phone's ringing. Time to go. <laughs> Patreon.com forward slash John D. Ruddy. Thanks, folks.